Libya is aiming to boost oil production by the 8% by December, a level that would catapult it to the highest in a, over a decade. Uh, North Africa's biggest producers should be able to pump about 1.3 million uh, barrels a day by the end of the year. Uh, Farhad Bindara, chairman of the National Oil Company, they said in an interview, avoiding field closures and steps like improving all workers' pay already helped boost output by nearly a quarter since January 2022 to 1.2 million barrels a day now, he said. Libya has been dogged by political turmoil ever since the overthrow and killing of leader Muammar al-Qaddafi in 2011, uh, with a political stalemate pitting rival governments and factions uh, against each other. Uh, and as crude production has frequently been held hostage uh, to infighting, although output has held steady this year, uh, offering hope that the country's troubles uh, might abate. And Vendor has said that $17 billion of investment across 45 projects would allow the National Oil Corp to raise production to 2 million barrels a day uh, within five years. Uh, and if we sustained that, uh, that would far exceed uh, anything uh, achieved during Gaddafi's rule. The government will offer rights to develop additional fields next year. Uh, he said NOSC is restarting natural gas supply from the Melotov complex after maintenance. Ben Dara said flow should remain stable for the next five years after the work, he said. Uh, the NOC on Tuesday signed a $1.05 billion deal with Italy's any Spay to capture flared natural gas, uh, a project that should start operating in 2025. Uh, and international companies are working in the country to expand production um, at some of its main fields, like the Waha deposit. Italy's any SPA and BP plague are set to start new drilling operations uh, by the end of 2024, then drop, said.